I need a Bible. Thank you. Monique Jones runs the Outreach Center for the historic St. James Missionary Baptist Church in Fayetteville. And this evening, our volunteers are packing bags filled with supplies to hand out to the less fortunate. A sanitizer, a hot hand. The church does this every month, and it's just one of several community services that a church offers, including back-to-school drives. 2,500 backpacks was our goal last year, and we hit it with partnerships, with community. Offering warm beds to the unhoused during zero degree temperatures. When it started warming up, we had a resource day, like how can I help you? Do you need to look for a job? Do you need to look for housing? And providing a local food pantry twice a week. It's not just canned goods and dried beans. We want to offer options to our community to make sure that they can live better lives and their children can live better lives as well. Whether it's feeding stomachs or the soul. So God, we thank you that you're the giver of life, God. Jones says St. James' history of service dates back to 1865, when Squire Jehagan started the church after he was freed from slavery. It wasn't just his dream, it was the church's dream. It was our organizational dream. And then we need to share these dreams with the youth today so they can continue to move forward in serving. Allowing the next generation to evolve that dream, the church sends its high school seniors throughout the country to tour historically black colleges. Offered that, um, that little push to say, oh, I see someone that's making it and doing it, and they look just like me, and they're smart as I am. And back home. There, almost there. Growing that dream through partnerships with other faith groups like the Latter-day Saints. No matter what the denomination, the race, color, creed, we have a common goal of loving our community and serving our community. Bringing a history of service into the present. One stylish donation at a time. Perry Elliott Durrani, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.